Uh, yo, so uh, they're giving us a bunch of data. I'm not going to put that data in my calculator. It's not needed. They're asking me for the 75th percentile. So let's go through it again. How do you do the percentile? Step one, take P over 100 times N. So this is going to equal P, which is 75. That's the P over 100 times N. N is the total number of values, right? How many values are there here? Let's 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 uh, number them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen values. So n is sixteen. N is always the number of values. So if you do that in your calculator, I think you'll get twelve, won't you? Let me double check. Yeah, getting twelve. All right. Step two, and this, this um, if, if you get a decimal, now we did it. We got a whole number, didn't we? This is a whole number this time. So I'm going to show you the other, but we are, I'm going to just write it out just to be thorough. If you get a decimal, you remember you round up. If you get a decimal, you round up. Um, but if you get a whole number if you get a whole number which is what we got we got a whole number then you take your let's let's say you find you find the data value in that spot and the next spot Add them and divide by two. In other words, you're going to average them. So basically, if you get a whole number, you're going to average two data values is what you're going to do. So that's what we got. We got 12. So I'm going to find the 12th number, which is right here, since I already numbered them, right? The 12th number is right there. So you take that and the next. This is the 12th. This is the next, the 13th number, right? So you take the 12, so you take 18.3 and 21.2. You add them and divide by two. You take the average, you take right in the middle of that. That's what it means when you add them and divide by two, right? You get the middle of those two numbers. Add them and divide by two. I'm getting 19.75. Remember when you add them and divide by two, don't forget to hit equals at the end of the numerator before you divide by two. Otherwise, you're only going to divide the, the second number by two, the 21.2. You have to hit equals when you're done with the numerator before you divide so that you divide the whole total by two and not just the last number. So 19.75, that's the answer to my question. 19.75 is the 75th percentile. That means that data value is 75% of the way through the data. If we read, these were a bunch of quiz scores again, you know, from a low to a high. Boy, these people did bad on the quiz, huh? Ones and twos, and the high got 29. So if we rank these from 0% to 100%, a percentile ranking system, they're asking us to find the 75th percentile, then 75% of the way through the data would be a quiz score of 19.75. So if you got 19.75 on the quiz, you're 75% of the way through the data. You did better than 75% of the class is what that means. So there we go. That's how we find that.